Husband had an affair with my sister for months. Sister is gloating about it, and mom says it's my fault. It started eight months ago. My sister, 28F, moved back into town. She has not lived here in 10 years, as she originally left for college and never came back. We grew apart. We talked maybe once a year, and I haven't seen her physically in four years. I've, 31F, been with my husband, 29M, for eight years, married three. She has met him twice in the entire duration of my relationship with him. He's a quiet and serious man who only opens up in front of me and a few of his select friends. She was struggling to get a job here, so I thought I'd be a good person and ask my husband if he could maybe help her find a job at his company since they work in the same type of field. Fast forward to current times, they actually work in the same department now. He's been acting more closed off towards me lately, but he claims everything is fine when I ask him what is wrong. We had our traditional family Christmas meal yesterday, and at first he tried to get out of it. This is not something he's ever tried to do, and I was very confused by this. After some convincing, he finally agreed to come along. My sister pulled him aside a few times, and they were in a very deep conversation as if the rest of us didn't exist. When I approached them every time, they both would jump a little, and when I'd ask what they were talking about, they would say, a work project that's near deadline. I was feeling a little off about their behavior. But the one thing that got me the most was at one point he got up to go get himself another drink. She was sitting in a chair that was next to the kitchen door, so he had to pass her to go to the kitchen. When he was near her, she put her hand up and reached towards him, and he caressed her palm and lightly grabbed her fingers as he walked past her. She looked up at him with a big smile. He looked down at her and nodded his head. As soon as he was out of sight, she turned her head towards me and smirked at me. When it was time for dinner, there was a main dining table that seats most of the guests. There was a second table that could seat an additional four people. She sat down at the side table, away from everyone else. I got my plate and sat down at the main table, but saw that he sat down at the side table with her. I told him there was a seat next to me, and he told me he wanted to sit where he was at. I decided to join them, and they went from actively talking to each other to just sitting in silence while we ate. I later asked him what that hand touching was about, and he said, it's just a high five. I said it didn't look like a high five, and he said that's all it was. I've never had any reason to suspect him of cheating, but this has me feeling on edge. I've been battling with myself to investigate further. Another thing is that he doesn't focus that strongly when he and I talk. It's always just short answers and lighthearted. They were having some intense conversations where he was hanging on her every word and giving her in-depth responses. Would this make you feel like something is going on? There were several instances where they were both on their phone texting at the same time as well and glancing at each other sometimes. That could be nothing, but after everything else, it made me feel uneasy. After this, I asked my husband if he'd go on a little weekend getaway with me. We went to a cabin up in the mountains. Neither of us had cell phone service. I planned for that as I wanted to make sure I had his full attention. The first night went fantastic, and I almost forgot everything about my concerns with my sister. When we woke up the next morning, we cooked breakfast together, but he was rather quiet. I asked if he'd go on a little walk with me, which he agreed to. When we reached the lake, there were some large rocks that you could sit on. We both sat on the same rock, and we sat there in silence for what felt like forever. I finally got the courage to bring up the concerns I had with my sister and him, and his face went white. He admitted to falling in love with my sister. He said that it all started because of how much they have in common. They spend more time together at work than he does with me at home. He said he feels like he can talk to her about anything, and it never gets tiring. He said he's never felt more alive than he does when he's with her, and they started having a physical affair in October. The emotional affair began in June, after working with her for a couple of months since the end of April. He apologized for hurting me, deceiving me, and betraying me. I asked him what he wanted to do about it, and he said that as much as he knows it will hurt me to say, he no longer is in love with me. 
The most painful thing I've ever heard in my life is when he said that the way he feels for her made him realize that he's never once felt that way for me, even at the time when he loved me the most. He said it's not comparable by any measure, and he doesn't feel right staying married to me. We are splitting in agreement that the marriage is over, but yes, I am heartbroken. They have both applied to transfer jobs to a different city with the same company, and he offered to let me keep the house. I told him that I didn't want the house, because it reminds me of him slash us. We have split the finances, and he is giving me more money than he is taking. We are getting ready to list it for sale, and I have been packing and doing odds and ends like painting. He said I could keep the full amount of the house sale. New carpet and flooring comes tomorrow, and the movers come this afternoon. I found a small house for myself to start fresh, but I know it will take some time for me to not be so heartbroken. My sister, on the other hand, is not handling it as kindly as he is, and she is gloating. She said it was accidentally, but I know it was on purpose that she sent me a photo of both of them where you can tell she is in heaven because she won him away from me. She changed her profile photo to a picture of her taking a selfie of herself smiling very smug as he is kissing her forehead. I unfollowed her on TikTok because now she's posting videos and photos of them together. Some of them are from months ago and it kicked me in the heart. I asked him if he could please ask her to stop. He said he'd talk to her about it, but nothing has changed. I have removed myself from social media for now, except for Reddit. My mother is favoring my sister's side, saying that she's not posting those things to hurt me and my sister deserves to be happy. My mom said it's my fault for looking and I need to stop being so petty. My father is taking the white flag and said he'd like to stay out of it. He said it's not right what my sister did, but she's still his daughter. He said he won't accept their relationship and he is here for me for whatever I need, but he won't be in the middle of this. I respect his decision on that. I'm sure it's not an easy place to be in. How should I proceed from here? Should I confront my sister one last time or just cut her out of my life completely? What would you do in my situation? I'm torn between staying strong and letting go or standing up for myself. Let me know your thoughts in the comments.